Hello! Oh my god, I have been wanting to watch <laughs> episode 3 for a couple days now. However, I haven't been able to film because we had a bunch of stuff going on, so I haven't had time to sit down and record or watch anything. I am so excited to watch episode 3. I'm two episodes in, I already feel hooked. So, that's great. What have we learned so far from Breaking Bad? We have learned how to cook. And we have also learned not to put acid in a bathtub. Oh shit, I left it in the bath. I don't have too much to say here. I'm just going to say I hope you're doing well. If you want to join me on my Breaking Bad journey, please subscribe. It, uh, it, it's good when you subscribe because it helps me grow and it gives you stuff to watch. <laughs> that should be my new motto. Please subscribe. It gives you something to watch. <laughs> If you are interested, I will have the extended and uncensored reactions on Patreon. Plus, you can see my videos early there, like movie reactions, all that sort of stuff. But let's get into Breaking Bad Episode 3, which is called And the Bags in the River. So, uh, we're going to see more body stuff, aren't we? What the fuck is that? Oh god, we're cleaning up the body, the bones and stuff. We have to buy a whole new bathtub, don't we? <laughs> We're only bloody 10 seconds in and I feel sick. <laughs> I literally just had meatballs for lunch. So I'm... My stomach is not enjoying this. Got a whole skeleton to account for. You would think, right? Oh! That's his jaw. There's got to be more to a oh. human being than that. Come on, please. Please, we're done. We're done. No more. I hate these shoes. These shoes make me look like I should be changing bedpans. Hey, don't disrespect the nurses. Then why are you wearing them? I like the support. My arches happen to be extremely archy. Yo, what's up? We love the word yo so far, don't we? <laughs> I'm Skylar White's son, yo. <laughs> <sighs> Not like it's any of your business, though. <sighs> Why does this kid remind me of that dude from South Park? <laughs> Jimmy? Is it Jimmy? Uh, it's the crutches, man. The, cr the crutches give me that vibe. Wow, well, it looks like when it comes to comedy, I really take the kick. I really take the kick. I really take the kick. It's about right there. Should you be up on that ladder? Should you be talking to me? I don't see we don't just go well to do it. Yeah. <sighs> He's probably too high to help out, actually. You smoked your fair share of pot in college, didn't you? Just let Walter smoke pot. Holy crap. Um, if we weren't meant to have it, then why is it on the earth? Do you remember it having an effect on your mood, like changing it in any major way? Or... Oh my God, I hate her so much. Um, you know, it's just a character thing. <laughs> I'm stuck on. Never mind. Walter Jr.'s on pot. What? No, Walter Sr.'s on pot. What would make you even- Where's he getting it from? Marie. Seriously, is it this Lewis? What are you gonna do about this? Marie, I am strictly asking about a story that I am writing. That's all. To be fair, at least she's having the decency to not just out Walter. Jesse, be careful, you know. <laughs> Bro, normally I'd get it on my back. <laughs> I would never go in that bathroom ever again. Why would you want to go in there? You were gonna have the worst trip ever. After what you've just gone through, you decide to smoke. Oh God, please, no more. Whew. Sounds like after you have a laxative. Oh. Okay, it was that guy's shit. He looks so defeated. This. This here. 
I wouldn't do this to my worst enemy. <coughs> this is degrading. Well, yeah, no shit, it's a bike lock. That makes you feel like you're a bike. You don't have it in you, Walter. <coughs> How do you know my name? Jesse. He told me to me. Jesse keeps fucking it up. What else did he tell you? Pretty much everything you could think of. <gasps> he was a high school teacher. One time he thought about carbon dioxide but making grape soda in class. Well, now we're gonna have to kill him, aren't we? That partner of yours? He's got a big mouth. Yep, definitely seems like it. So I should just let you go then? I don't see what real choice you have. <laughs> he knows too much. He knows you're a teacher. He knows all about you. You can't let him go. You asshole! You told him my name. Says who, him? Where I work, you told him about my son! Damn junkie! No, give me that! Out the window! Pyong! That's worth 40 grand, you stupid it's shit! It's worth nothing! 40 grand?! Get off the toilet! Get off the toilet! Okay! Jesus! If I had something coming out my ass, it's just going right back up! No! Oh god, now that's gonna be some shit meth. No! No! Malcolm! <laughs> I did my part. You mean that obscenity that I spent the last two hours cleaning up? That is your contribution? No, kiss my peak ass, man. I didn't ask for any of this. We're doing this outside? You didn't follow my instructions. Oh, well, Heil Hitler, bitch. And let me tell you something else. We flipped a coin. You and me. Coin flip is sacred. That is true. Coin flip is sacred. Just as sacred as camera lens, camera lens flip. I don't know what either side of this means. Excuse me, do you have these in black? Mm -mm. Isn't that already black? You can't get blacker than black. Dumbo, they are black. They are black heels. Actually, and it's a delicate subject, so... You fucking idiot, they're black shoes. Kind of in the middle of something. Here. Get out of here. Okay. Sit your ass down, Capron, now you two sit down! <laughs> Calm down, Hank! I'm back, babe. What's up? <laughs> hey, yo. He's smoking it. Oh. Uh, excuse me. His own mother seems to think so. No, he's not. Oh, my God. She strongly inferred it, like... Oh, my God. I think they're red heels. Tell him some horror stories. Maybe show him some autopsy pictures. Maybe make him have a bad trip or whatever. I figure his dad should be the one doing this thing, don't you think? Hank... He respects you. Hank seems like an alpha male. He seems like he'd listen to the Joe Rogan podcast. Where's my sugar? <laughs> King shit. I think I like Hank. She's just gonna walk out with him? You thief! She didn't even pay! Oh, we need to get your husband Hank to talk to you about stealing. Holy shit, that man has dinner plates for earrings. A little detour. We're gonna come over here and check out how the other half lives. It's like, what? This here is what we call the Crystal Palace. Oh, you know who lives in the palace? Crystals? Oh, you guys funny? Yeah. That's funny, huh? Yeah. Let me tell you something. Uh, how do you think they got started? I don't know. He has no clue. That gateway drug was marijuana. Every time. Understand? Yeah, bro. What the f*** are you talking about? Hey, hey, you! Yeah, you, princess! Uh, what are we doing? Oh, Jesus Christ. She has seven children she doesn't see. That's what I'm talking about. That's up, you cat. I say you can open your mouth and hands off the car. You want to touch my boobs for five bucks? What's your name, sweetheart? Candy. Wendy. Oh, close. How much you charge for a Wendy, Wendy? Two dollars and a can of Coke. Come on, Wendy. Let's see those pearly whites. Oh, fucking Jesus. What do you brush your teeth with a toilet brush? Smoke anything else, Wendy? Sausages don't count. <laughs> I, I like Hank. I'd be saying in a church choir. What do you like? Handicapped? Oh, uh, I just like handies. I uh, get rid of the caps. So tell me, Wendy. Do you smoke pot? Why? You got some? <laughs> Puppy. Get lost. So, what do you think? He doesn't know what the f*** is going on. Lock it, lock it. 
Who the hell was that? Jesse, what are you doing here? I think they just wanted pot. Oh my god, why are you here? Oh my <sighs> god. Jesse, you have so many other options out there, my man. Sky, you there? You're at the car wash. Yeah. I seriously doubt that. Since you quit two weeks ago. <sighs> I called Bogdan looking for you. Quite an earful he gave me. Listen. Uh, Come on, man. Recovery, recovery. Why don't you just stay there tonight? I don't want to side with Skylar a little bit, but you have been extremely distant and have not told her anything. She probably thinks you're f***ing some young student or something like that. What are we making? Ham and mayonnaise sandwich? Oh, we're making a sandwich for the guy in the basement. I was going to say, why are you cutting the crust off? And then I clicked. <coughs> Hey, mother are you just coughing all over my sandwich? <laughs> oh. He looks so unimpressed. Uh... Um... What the fuck? Are we good or is the cancer really starting to get to us? Damn. I didn't think you were coming back. That was really scary. Now you're gonna have to go back upstairs and make another sandwich. I've got lung cancer. I'll go make you another sandwich. <laughs> Just uh, roll it down the stairs this time. Otherwise, you know, you might drop the plate again. That's so sad that he put so much effort into making that sandwich as well. Just for him to faint and drop it all. He's only giving him a beer because he was very embarrassed that he- <laughs> Oh, just shake the fucking beer up as well. Expert over here. I sure as hell am looking for any reason not to. I mean, any good reason. Tell me what it is. I have a dog. And what's best for both parties is we forget all about it. But you know that anybody in my situation will make promises like that. Hmm. What would you do? What would I do? I think I'd have to kill him. I wouldn't be able to trust him. I think when my son was born that we bought his bassinet there. Yeah, no, I remember that. I remember recognizing your dad from those commercials. Jesse is not going to be happy that they have essentially bonded when he was meant to be dead. You ask him for a glass of water? So you need an extended warranty on the ice. <laughs> 16 years ago, how old would you have been? It was after school. Trust me, I was there. I don't know if he's just building trust or he's genuine. I mean, you know, he's not going anywhere. You may as well get him blasted in the basement. Jesse, you know you got cancer? Like nobody knows, man. Not a conversation I'm even remotely ready to have. <sighs> oh, Frank, he looks broken. I don't know what to do. Yeah. You do? It's like, no, I actually fucking don't, man. We'll get the key. Oh, we're letting him go. Oh, God. How the fuck is this going to go? Oh, no. Walt, I don't know if this is a good idea or not, dude. I have a bad feeling this is going to backfire. What did he just see in the trash can? What was in there? Plate? What caught your eye? Why'd you turn back around? Oh! The dude in the basement has the other shard. You let him go, he's gonna stab you. Like he was just building your trust up! Why are you doing this? It's either he was building trust for Walt to let him out, then he was gonna stab him, or he slit his throat. No, okay, shit. Frank. Don't. He's got the other bit of the plate. Oh. Live and let live. Just confront him. 
Where's the other part of the plate? Just say that. Don't. Don't unlock him. Are you going to stick me with that broken piece of plate? Oh! 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 oh, oh. Ah! I swear I said something about the bike lock being used to suffocate him. I swear I said something like that. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Well, I mean, Jesse's gonna be happy about that, isn't he? You know who's not gonna be happy about that? That dude's dog. Oh, it's gonna be so lonely now. <laughs> now, where are we gonna put this guy? The plastic tubs are gonna come in handy this time? Or are you gonna chuck him in the shower? Walt's already moved him. Where the f*** has Walt taken him? Mr. White is feeling a little under the weather this morning. I wonder why! We are going to be watching a very interesting video on... Carbon. Yay! Very important stuff. I love carbon. What is that? Ah, it's cook site. Gotta be. Nobody came where the hell out of here just to buy. <gasps> oh god, is Hank gonna be on Walt's track? Got a couple of dually tracks headed away towards the road. They're in some kind of camper slash lab. They accidentally start a fire and everybody FOs. Yeah, why not? Everybody FOs. Fucks off. <laughs> I'm gonna start using that now. How about you FO? I already searched it. Yeah. You're wasting your time. No, he's not. He's going to find something you didn't find. <laughs> Bingo! <sighs> Hello, Zippy. Asshole. DEA actually stands for doing everything awesomely. That's, <laughs> that's what Hank thinks it means. You got something? The mask? Yeah, it's the mask. Oh my god. Hank's going to be on Jesse and... Frank's, um, Frank, fuck. Jesse and Walt's tail? That's gonna make me very upset if that happens. <laughs> Cause I like Hank and I like Walter. You're in trouble. Skylar White Yo is about to beat your ass. Uh -oh. There's something I have to tell you. Oh no! Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking joking? That's how we're gonna end the episode? <laughs> Did you see that meth whore? Holy crap! Oh no, you can't end it like that! Oh, and this is why I just want to keep watching. And this is why it's dangerous for me to be watching this show, because in turn it becomes an addiction. So that was episode three. I knew at some point we were going to approach the I have cancer part, but I didn't think about how tough it's going to be to do. That is that is not going to go down well with Skylar at all. Oh God, I'm not ready for that. I'm also interested. What the hell did Walter do with the other guy? Did he buy the plastic containers or did, like what happened? I guess we'll find out next episode, most likely. Uh, so thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you want to join me on my Breaking Bad journey. Extended and uncensored cuts on Patreon. I'm going to go because otherwise I'm literally going to watch another four episodes and I actually cannot do that today. <laughs> and that makes me very sad. So hopefully you check back in for episode four. If not, and you're a regular... I'll see you for the movie reaction this weekend. I don't know how to end these. They're not like my movie reactions. So I'm just going to... Bye-bye.